Now, the Minister for State of Youth Development, Ayodele Olawande, and the President of the National Youth Council of Nigeria, Sukubo, Sarayigbe Sukubu, have commended President Bola Tinubu for his laudable empowerment programs. Addressing the youth body and his affiliate, the Minister for State and Youth Development, Olawande was represented by the spokesperson of the River State All Progressives Congress, Dalintin Hongoju, revealed that President Tinubu's administration is really resolute in creating meaningful opportunities for Nigerian youths. <laughs> Earlier in his remarks, the NYC and President Sukubo Sara Igbe taught President Tinubu to do more to ease the hardship in the country. He commended the President for appointing competent youths to leadership positions. On his part, the NYC and Deputy President Innocent Ndwanya charged the President to proffer a permanent solution to joblessness and youth restiveness. We used today to celebrate our international African and National Youth Day celebrations. His key interest is youth development and how we can also equally support our dear country, Nigeria. We focus on how our government at all levels can be youth friendly and youth inclusiveness for uh, their activities and their policies. And we also urge the president, he has, he has proved for us that he promised us that he is going to work with youth. And we can see the two ministers being given to us, the Minister for Youth Affairs and Minister for uh, State Youth Development, all are between the youth uh, constituency. And we believe vividly and we want to know too well that based on this one, we now have hope that the President is willing and ready to work for the interests of Nigerian youth. But we still appeal to him to, to do more and put more youth in prison, in prison in his cabinet and other appointments. The federal government will give serious attention to the yearning and aspiration of Nigerian youth and provide a permanent solution to joblessness and youth restlessness among our young people. As we grow future enterprises, we should also grow future leaders that will take this country to its promised land. A nation future is in the hands of its youth. So it is critical to channel our youth on radio energy and set it in the right direction by skillfully channeling the energy. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.